everybody, Ginger Shadow here, and welcome back to some more of the Fairy Tale Project. Which for the last two days we've been, uh, the last two days we've been streaming, and now there's the, yeah, we're not, we're not streaming it today. No, today we're doing an episode. Might stream something later, might not. I haven't decided yet. We'll, 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 we'll see how I feel. But anyway, but though we're here, we're doing some bits off camera. I also need to sleep, so I'll use some of my energy point things. Uh, can I? Yes, finally. I'll see if I can get my hands on someone. Oh, yeah, so, um, right, let's just go take a look at the progress. Let's go see what we've been up to. So, the gold, uh, last episode, uh, the which we streamed, we pretty much just focused on building the guild up a bit more. AK, we started focusing on building these extra room bits because we're going to try and do stuff with these extra rooms. What exactly? I haven't really figured out yet, but we're going to probably do something. I've also decided to make the decision that the entrance point to this one will be upstairs. Probably going to make this one library and it's room something. I don't know. I'll figure something out. Anyway, we've also got this upstairs bit, which gives us a bunch of extra space up here. Don't actually have a plan for what I want to do with this extra space, but here it is. Also, that faker there needs to get himself murdered. Hello! You son of a bitch. Uh, he's now on the hit list. Uh, right, he's on the list of people that he's a stern talking to because I... People don't seem to really learn. My daughters aren't just for you to take as you please. <laughs> yeah, he, he did the thing as well. He did. Will is now married to Soul Flare. Soul Flare 456. So he's now on the list of people that aren't on the best terms with me. As you can see, though, he is also part of Grim Shade Guild, whatever the hell it's called. So there's that. Apparently, I also crashed him there when I killed him. Awesome. Although he seems to be breaking quite a bit. Yeah, that wasn't too smart. I didn't even see a full thing of why you shouldn't just marry my daughters without saying a word to me. And yet this fecker did, so... <laughs> He's on a short list of people that if I see, I'll be, I'll be doing stuff with. I had to just attack him there because he keeps leaving, but, you know. I had to have words with him. But right, anyway, um... Oh yeah, I've got our son. I was thinking, I've been on a string of just having sons lately. I don't know why. Because I had lots of daughters before, but never been on a string of having sons, so... That's the thing. Oh, so we have to make like another bedroom now, I think. Yeah, now I've got nine children. But all. So, gonna have to make some space. Right, yeah, so I'll put, put my new son in here for now. Uh, what the hell are we naming this one? <laughs> oh, we've got Dio, we've got Jotaro, we've got Toko. Uh... <laughs> Oh, I don't actually know. I haven't really made plans of what I name my children. I just sort of keep naming them and just keep going. Uh, call them Rin. Boo. There we go. Our new son. Right, you. Also, I was having a look to see if, um... No, not, not follow me. Stay here. Uh, I was having a look to see if there's any ways to, like, change how they look. But there's not... Unless you, like, get the villager editor, there's not really any way. I thought, like, these two have an old item clothes that let you change an NPC's look. But that's... That's not the case anymore, so that's annoying. Right, anyway though, solar flare. Oh, is it still on? Oh, he's still on. Oh. I seem to have some words. So, decided to marry daughter without telling See what he has to say about that, I suppose. But anyway, yeah, I'm happy with the guild now. Now it's got those little extension bits than I was before. And I don't know, I need to do something with these bloody towers, but I don't really know what yet. But either way, the place is starting to look more like, you know, I'm a, a, a building of sorts rather than just a square box in the middle of nowhere. So I'm happy that we're doing stuff with it. I'm not too sure about everything else because as we know, I'm not very good at building roofs. Um, evident by this point right here. The roofs are going to be a problem. Also, I don't even know what I'm doing with these things. I put these towers in, I'll, I'll probably make, I don't know, maybe ways to get upstairs from downstairs. I might put something in one or two of them. I don't know. I'll figure something out. We'll do it. We'll probably do something with that at some point. All right. Anyway, up at my office, some things. So this doohickey here uh, exists. Uh, I can make use of this thing. So I am now at a level where I can get to level five. Awesome. So let's do that. Now, I need to get, I need to build an advanced developer to learn any level 5 skills, but that's fine. That's something to worry about later, because I'm not worried about that right now, because we've got more important things on hand. Mainly, I spent some time raiding, sorry, helping save 
some village town places and I've been using my shield a bunch while doing that. Mainly the automatic gates in Ancient Warfare, um, like up and down. Yeah, so those are really, really good to put the shield against because they just give constant experience until they die, which makes them really efficient where when you activate it to when it powers down. So, yeah, that's the thing. But now we can learn our new ultimate skill, Meltdown. Oh, lovely, lovely. We can learn this, and we can also learn the brain power thing. So that'll be handy. Also, we're getting all that power back really quick. Also, we need to quickly see what the situation is, what the fool over there is saying in a second. Hold on. The hell's that ability? <gasps> what is that? That looks new. I've never seen that before. I don't know what that is, but I want to see it. Da -ba! Hold on, right, go. Ba -ba. What is that? Yeah, these are the brain powers. That's brain lasers. What's this? Electron missile. Wait, but jet engine. What the hell's electron missile? I don't know. Ooh, that's something to look at. Also, luck. Oh, yeah, that's what I was in there before. Right, okay. Cool. Well, we've now powered up. What are our stats looking like? Now we're going to 9,000 CP. And we can now use the witch, I call it. Wrong button. Uh, get rid of the light shield. We can now learn the meltdowner technique. <laughs> which is a fabulous technique. It's a giant ass laser that does lots of things. Also, uh, she should just me, I swear. You still married her? Didn't have to say yes. She used all the Boruto references in the right ways. So now you. Right, lying. Now you can stop me by lying to me. Well, this poor fool has just written his death sentence. That's not even the thing. That's not even a saying. What the hell am I talking about anymore? I don't know. Ah, uh, I've got a new laser to test out. Should we go test it? Where's Grimshade? Hold the bus. Screamshade's not that far from here. Might have to pay a visit to it. Uh, that's Twilight Rose. Yeah, that's Grimshade. Let's go pay a visit to Grimshade. That's where the fecker lives. You can tell because he's got a different colour of marker from pugs. Oh. It's actually going to take me a while to get over here, isn't it? Yes. Yes, it will. Um, Right, hold on. It's been destroyed even more. It's hard to tell at this point. Oh, I need to find out the test is laser on. Now again, you've powerful laser thing to play with. But yeah, I'm quite happy I found a lock. This is the thing we've been aiming for since I got Meltdowner was to get the Meltdowner skill because it's really awesome. Although I never won that electron missile thing, so that'll be fun. I need to power myself up a bit and go get that at some point. I will right, see how that goes. What the fucking hell is that? Also, I'm saying it'll take us ages to get there. I can fly. What is that? Feck. The okay, tree's upside down too. Something really fecking weird's happened over here. Alright then. Ah, <laughs> oh, that's just weird. Okay, well, we're gonna... Hold on. Why is there people there? We need to find him. He's just taking a piss at this point. Yeah, no, he's going on a hit list at this point. Um... That was this is not the way you speak to me about this situation. It's just that's the way you speak to me if you want me to basically just attack you, so Oh Dragon will now have company. Anyway. Da 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 let's keep an eye out in case I see him on the map. Hell Grimshade's away over here. This is weird. I love the fact I can just fly over though. Like I was gonna like this is good just sorry, it's gonna take me bloody ages. Oh wait, angel form. <laughs> It makes a 1500 block journey that would have took like 50 minutes. Well, not take 50 minutes. Take like 5 minutes down to like 1. So, much, much convenience there. Although, I'm probably lagging the server quite a bit doing this. That would not surprise me. Right, um, he's not over here, is he? The vicar. No, no, he's not. Well, made a trip for nothing. Uh, is this actually developed anymore? No, it doesn't look like it is. But yeah, if he's missed it by This is Grimshade. This is the fourth guild that's been officially. Uh, set. Apparently has two members already. Let's get Solar Flare and it's got... Oh, let's get three members, I think. I think. Uh, I think it's got at least three members at this point. Well, never mind. Uh, oh, you've got no other members. I'm thinking in. That's fine. Alright, well, we'll need to... We'll keep an eye out. When we see him, we'll kill him. We need to find out where he lives, actually. That'll be fun. I mean, we are the Hunter's Guild. I could easily just say to the members, well, here's something for you. Just go hunt down this person. 
<laughs> find him. Find out where he lives for me. Like, you'd have to kill him. Just find, find, hunt him down, essentially. Seems like a fine mission for somebody if they fancy it. Also, that door's left open. Was that me? Possibly. Right, well, regardless, we'll deal with him later. Uh, I still need to test his laser, though. Got a good spot for this. I may have something marked. Uh, actually, no, before we do, though, before it reaches, like, 40 minutes and I forget. Whitelisting! One person was whitelisted from last video. That person is... Uh, well, K3N, but Ken underscore Kaneki. Uh, you've been whitelisted. Modpack IP went up. Should be down below. I'm guessing the threes, like, backwards E sort of idea. But yeah, uh, you've been whitelisted. Mod pack people not should be on Discord where it belongs. Now, here's your people. If you want a chance to get whitelisted on the server, leave a like on the video that you can give them down below for a chance to get on. Or if you're getting rank member or higher and you want to get on, just let us know and give them a whitelist. You know, bother. Oh, speaking of members, we actually got a new Ambu member freaking yesterday during the stream, which was a big surprise because like you don't see them. That's the third one I've ever had, so that was a big surprise in itself. But then it's like they didn't even ask to get in. They didn't ask to whitelist or anything. Just became a member. So that was something. Um. But yeah. Anyways. Buzz up buzz all. I need something to shoot with this laser. I need to test it. What have I got, Marks? I have got... Look at this town, Marks. Yeah, I didn't kill anything. Yeah, these are the gates I was talking about. The amount of gates here. Uh, if you just hold the shield up against it, it'll do damage to the gate and it'll eventually break. But while it's holding against the gate, it's just constant experience because it stays going. Let's see how this goes. A bit underwhelming, I suppose. Well... Well, I mean, okay, the original lasers did 12, and that did 21. Plus, that can hit lots of people at once. Like, if you get a big line of people, that will destroy all of them. Hmm. Plus, that was its damage without the extra, like, thingy. Ooh, perfect. Oh, wait, no. Go! Yeah, there we go. You heck off, you. Ba -da 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 -da. What the hell? Oh, you're a villager! Oh, gods! I didn't realize it was, oh, yeah, it was a villager over there. Yeah, villagers were just freaking evolved. Oh! Oh, now I killed them! Blades! Fire! Order! Die, all of you! God, I have so much magic. Ah! Hey, more! That's a fecker. Hello. Yeah, it's not a chance, mate. Yeah, the lasers, they do a fun thing, because... The lasers, once one hits, lowers the person's natural defense. The next one does more damage. So, if I hit it with the little laser first, then use the big one, I scared it quite a bit. I guess. That's something. Right, no matter. Oops. That was Ordo's Wrath there. Didn't need to use that. Anyway, yeah, this is one of the structures that I randomly found while I was floating around. I didn't bother clearing it out because I don't recall it having much. Although, another structure. This thing was just sitting here. This was interesting. So this is just a mob tower. It's got no NPCs in it or anything. It's just got mobs in it. And the top had some cool loot. And yeah, it, was just, it was just a nice structure to come across. There's also a wizard tower over there, but the wizard's in as a jerk. Like, he just randomly started attacking me for no reason. Uh, where the hell are we? We are here. Is there any other nearby structures? Not that I can see. I mean, there is one. There's a big tower thing there that was something. There's a base thing over there that was something. There's a house there. I've pretty much looted all this stuff already. I did, when on my travels, though, find another master book. Although the master book was another copy of the forest curse, which I don't even use. So, yay! Yay for master curses! I guess if someone has a different master curse that they want to trade for forest curse, which is a mass area of effect poison curse thing, then, you know, I, we could trade, but that's, yeah, that's, that's not really my cup of tea, that. I'm not really a poison user. Anyway, let's head back. So, Meltdown, an interesting technique that, yeah, if I want to hit a lot of people at once with a big laser, let's get to some stuff. Also, if you might notice, I've got it set so it doesn't, like, destroy terrain. Makes my screen freak out to hell, though. Feels smaller than before. It's gotten smaller. Eh, possibly not. Anyway, regardless, let's go back. Uh, do, 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 Guild. There we go. Well, can I press me to locate for later? So that's an ongoing thing. I don't even know where he lives. Uh, Solar Flare is one of the. He's one of the newer people, on, isn't he? Like. Where is his name? Is he in this bit? Yeah. 
What is... I don't know, he's in the last handful of episodes I remember he came on. I think. Or misremembering and thinking of someone else. Regardless, though. Pretty sure he's, he's not, like... He's not been on a... Maybe he's been on a tumble and I've not been on. That's possible. I suppose other people in the server have a better idea than I will. Alright, anyway, regardless. Uh, well, so Guild's making its way up there bit by bit. We're just, just going to keep building it bit by bit as I go. Obviously, it takes a little bit of time to build things up. Although, ooh, I think I got my adventures. I got a lot of experience. I also got loads of other random junk here. I should probably like, make use of some of this. Do -do -do -do. Uh, yeah, grab all this. We don't need this. Put that away. Uh, I got this. I got incinerary. Don't know what that does, but we've also got sweeping edge three. That's a good one for me sword. So I'll put that on my sword. I've got tons of stone and stuff. I might smelt it down. That's whatever. I did a lot more spells. I got our copy of bubble. Novice, novice, apprentice. I have tons of spells. Jesus Christ. I've got tons of freaking spells here. Interesting. Oh yeah, I got my not chapels and adventures as well. That was our random one. For whatever reason, I just got tons of that. Right, uh, I should probably drop some of this junk off. Should probably drop this junk off. Try and enchant, try and get a silk touch thing, because I'm still. Still need that. I had a silk touch thing, but someone seems to have stolen it, so. But, uh, but right, so that pretty much means I'm done grinding. Academy Craft. Uh, yeah, Academy Craft then. I'm done grinding Angel of Vengeance. I'm pretty much done grinding Avatar. I don't really need to grind that anymore. So I guess now it's time to move my focus onto a different type of magic, which. Electro Bobs, it's just get. It's just a. Unless I start abducting old men, I pretty much just need to go on the kind of luck factor of finding a good spell and finding a good wand. Unless I start, like, turning it into basically a sweatshop for old men. Like, th th unless I do something like that, it's not, I'm not going to be able to make much progress there, so that... I'm pretty much just putting that one down to potluck, which I'm not too, like, desperate for that right now. Like, I've got cool stuff here I can play with it. But then it becomes, like, what magic do I want to work on next? So, at this point, there's kingdom magic... There's Thumbcraft, there's Blood Magic, there's Roots, there is Bewitchment. What else is there? I feel there's at least something else that I can't remember. It's not Roots, it's the other one. Is it the Dwarf one? Why I just open the mod pack and check? <laughs> Actually, yeah, there's a fun idea. Why I just open the mod pack and look at what magics are there? Wait, hold on, so we've got... Da -da -da -da. So, Karen Card now we've done. Yeah, Blood Magic's one. Bewitchment's one. What else is there? Electro Bob's Wizardry, we're just kind of doing as we go. Uh, da, 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 da. There's a JoJo's thing. I've still not went and got a stand, actually. There's a thought. Oh, there's the Fate mod, too. I've not invested much time into that either, so that's something to look at. There's the, the Kingdom's Magic stuff. Malzy's mob still exists. I still haven't went and said hello to any people in that again. I think that's kind of random. Uh, do, 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 do. There's Roots and Rustic. There we go. That was the one I'm thinking of. There's Roots and Rustic stuff. It's Twilight Forest too, if I fancy. And Thumbcraft. I think that's all. So there's still a fair few magics I could start investing a bit of time into. So... Something to think about, I guess. Now, before that though, let's quickly enchant some things. Where's, where's my spare pickaxes? There's one, there's another. Is there another one? Yes. Fish. Right, grab some of this, grab some lepids. Throw lava bucket somewhere. Did I even know a lava bucket? I don't know why I've got it. Shove that in here. We're trying to get silk touch. Can we get silk touch? No. No, we cannot. Efficiency, efficiency, efficiency. Seriously, I'm getting one enchant, really? Really? Yeah, you're gonna do this to me? I just took a two there. Oh, that was dumb. Right, well, that didn't fucking work. I just got unbreaking efficiency three and unbreaking. What? That is so crap. How did this happen? Well, that's just plain annoying. Alright, well, that was fucking waste. Well, no matter. Right, let's put sweeping edge on my sword. We'll go from there. Oh, so there's nothing else. Nothing in any of these bags. Yeah, like I keep thinking like I've misplaced it somewhere. I haven't. It's just not there. Right, put that on there. Now gets the sweeping edge. So sweeping edge basically means now when I swing my sword, it'll do max damage to everyone it hits. So 
Effective for taking on crowds of monsters, but less effective when you're not trying to murder everything. Like, if you're just trying to target one person, that's going to be a problem. So I have to start carrying two weapons. Or I just use magic. That's an option, too. Right, um... Keep that staff as it is. Nerd staff. Should we learn some things with it? So, okay. Six sense is cool, but I literally start breaking... I, I literally cannot see when it's there. So, let's just replace that with other junk. So, we've got an advanced spell. We've got another advanced, another advanced. An apprentice. An apprentice. Let's see what we can learn. Also, that soulbound thing. That's worth keeping on. Curse of soulbinding is really powerful. Iron flesh is really good. I don't even know if imbue weapons are actually good, but it's there. Uh, replenish hunger is handy. There's actually quite a few useful spells here. But yeah, that curse of soulbinding, though. I think I want that on. Just in case I get in a fight with something, because that's just handy. So yeah, get a greater telekinesis and put that on. Just so I've got it on hand. Finish. That's a handy wee thing to have on. Because if I get in a fight with someone that's really, really powerful, well, that means they're going to start taking damage from it as well, so that'll be a useful strategy. Also, this bubble's spell. I need to get rid of it. Well, whatever. Let's go test stuff out. See what we've got in these books. Maybe we get something really cool and powerful. Maybe someday I'll actually... Like, I've got lots of staffs in here, don't I? So seriously, none that just take on my fancy does not, though, because I've already checked. There's these book ones. Book ones are quite cool, but there's no master level ones, I think. I think I've got a master. See, I've got a master cosmic staff in here, but... I don't even know why I'm carrying half the weapons in here that I'm carrying. Yeah, I've got this master cosmic staff, but, I mean, it doesn't look very... Right. It's not really for me, is it? I think I'd rather go around the of banner one of the books. Then I can start putting all these enhancements that I've got on. Because, yeah, I've got all these things here. I've got... I've got uh, can make such a good wand. <laughs> can make such a good wand. I just need I just need to find it. Whichever one it is. Alright, anyway though. Let's see what we can do with this. Oh, so let us know in the comment section then. Uh where we where do we think is the next magic thing I should pri uh, start prioritizing? Because electro buzz we're just gonna do as we go. As we find spells now, we'll test them. As we get wands, we'll use them. As we get better spells, we'll start placing them on our wands, not jazz. But there's not really, like, unless I literally start capturing old men and using them for trading and stuff, I there's no real way for me to get the stuff any quicker. It's just look around and find it. So aside from that, then becomes what magic should I play with next? So, as I said, Bewitchment, I think Bewitchment's a big one. Fate's a big one, I guess. Uh, Thumbcraft's a big one. It's got a lot of interesting stuff. Blood Magic, I don't actually know what 1.12 Blood Magic, like, I don't know how much of the 1.10 stuff it has, but, I mean, I remember, it's always been a big mod. That could be useful. I think they're kind of the bigger ones. I don't know how good Roots and Rustic are in terms of magic. I know they make alcohol. But that's about it. <laughs> so, I know. Let us know in the comments which magic you think I should, like, delve into next to power myself up a bit more. I've got, you know, a good level of combat ability than now, but I can always improve if I can get more nice things. But anyway, let's travel a little bit away. Let's have a little test of this, shall we? Oh, hello. Also, I think I need to have words with um, the Master of Grimshade, because apparently one of his little guys have just stepped out of line. What with Thingy. So fair deciding to be the cocky little bugger that he is. I mean, he's cocky than now, but when I get my hands on him... <laughs> like, is, is he going to be able to defend himself against me? Like, if I find out where he lives, he's fex. Because I don't take any amusement of what he's done. He's decided to try and answer in amusing ways. Oh, he screwed himself. Any chance he had to just, you know, beg for forgiveness is just gone. Everyone else made the right decision and just they turned tail and just went, right, I'm sorry. But the, but the, but the. This guy, after he saw what I did to everyone else, then decided it was worth doing it. And then decided, yes, yeah, so she seduced me and now have a, and now have a son and something. <laughs> Anyway, let's start doing stuff. Uh, but um, glide. That's literally just as if I had a glider. Uh oh. Oh no! Oh, it's decoy. Ah! Interesting. Okay, let's target him. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Ah! Um. Order! Hammer! Missed him. 
missed it. Uh, implode! Just die, you little. I don't need fire lying everywhere. Die, please. Thank you. Oh, I can actually drop blade rods. Noise. Uh, but oh. oh, I can use the I can use the decoy then. Oh, hello. Uh, yeah. Okay. Decoy. Wrong way. Wait, what? Firebomb material is in front of you. This, this is some type of fire spell anyway, that's for sure. Oh god. Ah! Uh, Whisper uh, to thingy. Oh, never mind. I thought sign had like some secret location thing. To this, but never mind. I was gonna say like, yeah, if 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 he's coming over to where Cyan is, <gasps> my armor. Boop, boop, boop. If he's going over to where Cyan is, I need to get over there and freaking get a hold of him. We have prime opportunity to go and deal with them. The hell? You're suddenly very hungry. Okay, I can't use any of these spells. Come, ow! All right, the woman up in flames. You had these test things are so annoying nowadays. That's right? Okay, what did we get? We got decoy. We got glides and decoy. They were my advanced ones. Wow. Okay, there was one advanced, one apprentice, and one apprentice. Then these two novice ones. How many? Look at these scrolls. Are really feck it. Use them. I can't be arsed dealing with this. Pocket furnace. That's what burnt my hands. Transience, right? Transience. The hell is that? It's a buff of some kind. And heal ally. Ooh, that's a handy one. The hell is this spell? Makes the caster transient transient for 20 seconds the caster is immune to all damage or transient but cannot break or place blocks or cause any damage shall we test that theory can i really not cause any damage i'm curious about that one because <laughs> i have some interesting magics i can throw out there right we need to get back to base because clearly he's at science location so back to the guilds let's get a hold of this cheeky bugger who thought he could just get my daughter and get away with it. Ah, well, we'll see about that, won't we? So, so, so. Da, 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 da. Yeah, I married one of my daughters without telling me. He deserved it. But da, da, da. Really, Saya, you're gonna shoot ice at me? Oh. The feck? See? Hold the fecking boss. Did you just respawn inside my place? Bye-bye. Hover! Anyway, uh, wait, is he respawning inside our building? I think he does. I think the fecker needs to die. Again and again. <laughs> oh, you stupid feck. You've made a horrible mistake. A horrible mistake. You've slept in my place. It's a terrible decision. Oh. 
Then I can just kill you over and over again. What are you going to do to stop me? Can I actually fight? I don't even know. I need three cards from Soul Flare. You're welcome to try and get them. I mean, you'll be respawning in a different location in a second anyway, so... You know, there's that. How'd that not hit? Well, whatever. Goodbye! He was destroyed from the inside. Da, 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 da. No, no, that didn't work. Apparently you can't kill people just as soon as they respawn. Da, 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 da. This armor's pretty tough, though. Oh, straight hand over the cards. Can I put blades here? Can he hit with the blades? The hell? So I NCL2 apparently. Taking far too much joy in this. Kinda need that card. Here you go, have a card. Back to business. <laughs> Actually I can check test this now. Transience! Now it cannot cause damage. Or can I? Let's find out. Will he implode? Will he die? He will not. Interesting. And transience is on. I literally can't hurt him. Well, that answers that question. Hey, right, now to um, I can't break blocks either. Oh, so you just threw me a master spell. Look, you can try. You can try and buy me off. It's too late for that now. Transience is better run off. Come on, transience, run out, run out, you fecker! Let me fight! Ah! God damn him! All done. And come on, let that white aura disappear. Any second now. Or just do that. But right, he shouldn't be able to. He shouldn't be with a fecker. All right, I'll just take this bed then. And do that. Why is he sleeping in my? He's not even part of my guilds. Oh. Like, the hell does he think this is? Dear, oh dear. Right, well, anyway, spawns nearby here, so I can still keep going after him. Um. Also, you might think this is cruel, but to be fair, he does deserve it. Then you went to another bloody guild. Not supposed to still be here at that point. Jesus, I'll spawn around here. Oh, there it is. That would be spawn over there, apparently. But yeah, he has no defense against my magic, though. Well, if he wants to beg forgiveness, he's gonna have to start doing it pretty bloody quickly. Otherwise, we can kind of see what's gonna be happening here. Um, it's giving me constantly punishing him for pretty much just shoving off the idea that they've married one of my daughters. Oh well then, at least they let me test one of my magic, though. Actually, speaking of which, what else have I got? Get heal ally, get glide, get decoy, transcend. So yeah, okay, that's gonna help. Can't use any of this for my amusement against him. But yeah, okay, transcend. That's an interesting ability. I don't care. You deserve death. What you did to my daughter and acted to me about it. Insult my intelligence, will you? That doesn't work. That's annoying. Oh, well, whatever. The faker can go. I don't kill him. Excuse me. There we go. No. 
I didn't kill him either. Oh, he's oh he's using thingy to keep himself alive. Oh yeah, I didn't sell him. Well, you give that one an effort. I'm fucking I'm bored of this now. Um, <laughs> I don't want to spend the next like I, I could easily spend the next twenty minutes just killing over and over because he annoyed me. But no, leave him be for now. Although if I see him anywhere near the guild, I'm just gonna annihilate him. So. That. And it's totally nothing to do with the fact that I'm running out of points to spend. Actually, I've taken my wind attacks. So that's the thing. So, uh, yeah, apparently Cyan, though, is um trying to make a blackjack machine. Or something. Yeah, so, yeah this is a weird one. Cyan, like, we mentioned the idea of uh, gambling and stuff uh, yesterday on stream. Because that, like, that is, we want to get a currency in this world. And pretty much use it for a lot of things. I could have tested my laser on him. Hold the boss. We're not done here. Why are these trees here? These are getting closer. Uh, but yeah, anyway. Uh, we mentioned the idea that if we make missions and stuff, we obviously want you know, to add currency into the world. We want it to actually mean something. All that jazz. So, you know, it's, when that mentioned, it was like, well, yeah, then you can also use it for gambling. Because technically you could at that point. Uh, so, yeah, science pretty much jumped on that. There is something called Fluffy nearby here, and I don't know what it is. Also, Badoosh! That is three. Seriously. My wind blades do more than that! Jesus Christ, the armor the armor does a lot there. The armor does a lot there. That's good to know. Now, if I ever need a test on me for any spells now, I know who I'm going to. Oh... Well, at least I shook off my initial rage overall. Yeah. Like that there fills. Like that there fills didn't say a word, word to me first, which wasn't very clever. As he's finding out now, I'm quite the vengeful person. Ah, da da da. When though, obviously, some point. No, since last stream, at least I think anyway. Cause I was chat. I've been chat. I've been going to say like speaking to my daughters every day, pretty much. So you know, I see like if there's any changes with them. Cause I literally check. Cause I'm having children all the time. So I'm in their rooms, like putting new children down, <laughs> like every day. But speaking of which, I do need to get another, um, need to get our room set up. Which I probably could do. Like, this is still an extra room. I still need to work on this damn place. You're already punishing the others. The plus soul was there when the others did that. Didn't know if he was, to be fair. Well, no matter. These fools never learn. I have two daughters left that are still pure. Oh, the ball. It's not, it's not even that bad the idea of them I'm not against the idea of them getting married. I'm just I, 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 against the idea of people marrying them because they fancy just marrying them. Like, it's disrespectful as all hell. They live under my roof. Like, they, they do that. It's just it's just not on. Now, I'm, if they're going to want to marry one of my daughters, I have to make sure they're like a, a good person, essentially. They're not just trying to use them to be related to me, for example. Or, you know, just doing it because they fancy at the time but have no way of actually providing for them. AK fools are marrying them and don't even have a house yet for them to live in together. It, it, oh. Science is the only one that's actually approached me saying, can you marry one of my daughters and said it first. The main thing is, though, Cyan just said, can I marry one of your daughters? And I'm like, instantly, no, because you just asked if you can marry one of my daughters. You don't care who you marry. You're clearly just trying to marry into power or something or my name or something. You just want to make daddy jokes about me, essentially. So, no, we're not falling for that. I don't think so. What's the ball? God damn it. Well, no matter. Also, he did just give me a master spell there. I might as well go see what it is. But da 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 Does it mean he's forgiven? But I will take it from him because I'm not giving up a master spell. Also, depending on what this master spell is, I might just be more insulted. Or I better find out. So, right, Transcend Transcendence is an interesting ability. Decoy is an interesting ability. Heal Ally I've got as well now, which also sort of interests me. Like, these are be handy abilities if we ever, like, want to heal people, I suppose. Urgh. If 
we ever want to heal people, slash, we ever have someone on who wants to learn to heal people, which, I mean, if Pat and I would just hurry up and just fold and join me, that'd be great, because then he could, like, learn stuff too. Like, why isn't Pat just a couple of series on here? <laughs> There's a thought. Why does he just do that? I mean, he's there. Anyway, Badish. Snowball. That's a novice move. Leap. That's not a novice move. Ow. That was awkward. Um. Speed time. Oh! Interesting. That's a handy ability. That'll let me sleep. Handy, but not useful really in battle unless you're a vampire. Which actually was another thing. I didn't add in the vampire magic mod. I didn't think it was a point, to be fair. Anyway. Let's so speed through the day. If it wouldn't lag. But we'll try and speed through the day, but it, the game's making it kind of awkward. Come on, come on! Go down, son! I can literally see the clock on my map, like, fighting with me. To go up and pass times. Jesus. This is annoying. This is how much the server's lying, apparently. People must be exploring. It's actually possible. Pugs is on. Pugs could be in the Twilight Forest for all I know. He seems to like hanging out there. Strangely, the guy with the Twilight name likes the Twilight Forest. It's kind of weird, that isn't it? Didn't see that coming. 1321. This spell is useless to me. I literally cannot change the time of day. <laughs> Ah, it still drains the magic as well, which is even worse. But yeah, trying to use this when there's lots of people on is quite hard. I just want to go night tins and get all my energy back. It's literally it. It's causing so much lag doing it. This is not a good spell to you. Yeah, I, can't, I wouldn't recommend using this spell ever. I, I put this as a spell that just should not be played with because it just causes mass lag in the server. Yeah, fake. It's not, it's not worth it. It's draining all my wand as well. The, the drainage is consistent, but it's not actually moving time. It's just causing tons of lag. I imagine people were suffering from block lag there when I was doing that. But oh. I also still need to figure out what the feck I'm doing with this. There's a cyan moving about. Can't sign because I can't see his name. But oh. Anyway. No matter. I need to find out where Soul Flare lives though. I'd have to pay him a visit anytime I want to fancy the testing a spell ability. Alright. Anyway, that fun out of the way, I think for today, we shall end things later. So right, speed time. I'm putting that on like the blacklist of like dark magics that you just, you don't toil with because it causes pain to the server. So if any fecker starts using that, that's, oh, that's going to cause problems because it just causes lag. It's not really, it's it's a complete waste. It doesn't really do anything, like really, because it's just lagging so much. So yeah, probably best we don't minute be like time like that. If something has this thing to suddenly change time to like, night then fair enough but when it's doing it like slowly like that it's just fecking up everything so it's not worth it it's not worth the effort also i can't sleep yet can i no i can't set my spawn though all right anyway people for today we'll end the video there thank you all very much for watching hope you enjoyed the show more work to be done more work on my house more work in the guild more work on my magic gonna delve into a new magic next don't know which one yet but let us know in the comment section which one you think it should be but again options being the likes of the fight mods bewitchment mod thumbcraft blood magic Ristikin, Ristikin Ritz are there, but I don't really know how those work. I don't know if they're, like, good or big, so, don't be those ones. But yeah, all that stuff's there, so which one do you think I should play with next? Let us know in the comments section down below. On that, though, guys, though, thank you all very much for watching. I'll see you all next time for some more of the Fairy Tale Project, where, uh, well, we'll see what we get up to, and we'll see if any more fools decide to play with my daughter, because I don't know. These people don't learn! <laughs> Why don't they learn? It's a terrible idea! I will find you and I will kill you for it. I will I, I will make you suffer for it. That is pretty much the thing. Like, I can't make you get divorced anymore. So I just have to make you suffer. It's one way or another. And you won't like it. So just don't do it. Talk to me first. <laughs> Be a reasonable person. Rather than just jumping into marriage with one of my daughters. God damn it, people. Have some brains here. But right, anyway, people, though. Thank you all very much for watching. See you on next time for our fairy tale project. Go buy it from Buddy. Also, just want to say a quick thank you to all the channel members for the extra support. And a special thank you to the Elite members, the Johnny members, Cheekston, Matthew OK, and Gold Dragon, and the Onbu members, Kel the Young, One Black Winged Dragon, and Aragon. Thank you all very much for the extra awesome support.